All right, coming up next, it is our main event, a matchup for the UFC Women's Bantamweight title. She is the undisputed. Fighters are 30 years old, and they have the same height and reach. All right, now for the particulars, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Hard round for the Undis... Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 23 wins, three losses. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds, presenting the challenger, John Magnum Wiley. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 23 wins, three losses. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC Women's Back and Weight Champion of the World, John Magnum All right, this is for the UFC Championship. I want you to build my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, so back your corners, come out fighting. You ready? You ready? Good to have you with us tonight from T-Mobile Arena, the home of the NHL's Vegas Golden Knights and the building in which DC shocked some of the MMA world at UFC 226, uh, but this venue will always have a special place. This venue holds a special place in my heart. UFC 226, I became the double champion. This is a fight venue that you should want to compete in. A great arena where you can make history. Tonight, you get your chance. Zhang's kick to the body, that one blocked. Well, she's been good tonight, but she missed with that one. Punch over the top. Nice 
land there with the right punch. Easy to see why that is her weapon of choice. Great right hand. Nice land. Well, she continues to leave that head open, and she paid for it there. She's almost moving into the strike. She hasn't changed up her tempo, and she continues to keep her head on that center line. We'll see if she can make the proper adjustments here. Try to establish that jab. Dig and kick. Oh, man, I hate to laugh, but she lands another kick there, and now you're really starting to see that visible damage on the other side. When you start seeing the redness in the leg, that means that every time she is driving that baseball bat right into the thigh where she wants it to land, and now her opponent is limping, her opponent's wounded, her opponent's injured, and now watch the targets be way more stationary. What a body And they separate. Great punch. She's going back to that patented straight right hand, unable to connect. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Oh, how good was that right hand? Beautiful connection by her there. Right down the pipe, right on the chin. So just over 20 total strikes, which have landed for Wei Li Zhang. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Yeah, she has to go chase the finish. Nice punch here. Oh, Superman punch! Nice kick. Sean going for the body. Missed with that kick. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Well, she's been good tonight, but she missed with that one. And she connects with a punch there, champ. She's so accurate. She's so good at timing all of her strikes. Oh! leg kick. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Big body kick lands. Just misses with a left hook there. Effective punch there by Sean Whaley. Look at the force behind that leg kick. 15 seconds. My goodness! Oh, big left hook there. Oh, straight right. The horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, there's the horn. Let us now check out some of the action from that round, DC. What a display of striking. Yeah, John, she did a great job. I mean, she knew exactly what she needed to do, and she mixed everything up beautifully, right? Every punch landed to a kick. Whenever her opponent thought kicks, she would follow up with punches. It was a master class in striking over you the ready? course of that round. You ready? Second round here. Leg kick. Went for the inside leg kick. Beautiful right hand over the top. 
Oh, beautiful combination there from Zhang Wei Li. She is throwing everything with fight ending intentions. I mean, you saw it in her title winning performance against Jessica Andrade. We had seen Andrade put people up over and over, and Wei Li landed that right hand, put on the first round. Yes. It was unbelievable to see, and she is continuing to do that in her performances since capturing the title. So we pull up the numbers here. 45 total strikes have landed for Wei Li Zhang. Just below 50% now landing with 47% accuracy against Wei Li Zhang. Oh, an instinctive land there as she goes to the jab, DC. Nicely done. That jab is stopping her in her tracks. And is not only a range finder, she is really damaging her opponent behind the jab. Oh, huge knee to the body. That'll soften her up. Oh, nice right hand. Good punch lands. And they separate. Lands the right hand. She's starting to put together some significant body work here, and these are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. All right, so there's that kick to the leg, and you can be sure she's going to go back to the well with that. She's beating up that lead leg, dominating it, and slowing down her opponent. Look for her to continue doing that same technique. Under three minutes now to go in round two. Nice. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, man, that looked like it hurt. Nice kick by her there. It absolutely did hurt. I can tell you that as a fact. Well, she has certainly picked up the pace here in round two and starting to find herself in the pocket a little bit. She was a little bit hesitant in round one. No hesitancy whatsoever here in round two. She has clearly found her rhythm and range. Just over two minutes now to go in the round. Oh, that right hand is on point. Under two minutes now to go. The right hand just misses. Oh, that's a good right hand. Oh, just out of range with that right hand. Nice punch by Jean. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, she's really starting to put together some significant body shots here, attacking both sides now. Good series of strikes by her there. She is staying wicked busy tonight. Very busy, but also super accurate. She is on point. Real nice body kick land. Just unable to quite find that range. Damaging punch there. Just misses there with the left. <laughs> 30 seconds now to go in the round. Wadley going with the kick to the body, but unable to find the range. 15 seconds remain in the round. What a punch. 10 seconds remain in round two. And that's the end of round number two. All right, so there's the horn indicating the end of the round, but not before damage was done. She was cut on her cheek from the strike in that round, and now the focus for the cut man shutting that thing and making sure it doesn't become a factor here moving forward. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays. You knew she came in with the book on her as a kicker, and her opponent did nothing to adjust. Her opponent didn't check one kick, so why would she not continue down that path? Why would she not continue to throw her hands just to set up those beautiful, nasty kicks? And she is landing them with full force every time she throws them. Nice head kick. 
Ripley. She slips that left hand there. Well placed kick there. Lands flush with that right hand. Nice leg kick, Lance. Big right hook attempt, but she misses. for the body, targeting that area with the kick, but unable to land. Well, how impressive is this young woman? High volume of strikes in the previous round and picking up exactly where she left off here and not really showing any signs of slowing down. She looks like she could go 10 hard fives tonight if need be. Kick to the body by Zhang Weili. Nice kick landed there by Zhang. The unofficial numbers thus far, 82 total strikes which have landed for Wei Li Zhang. Not the most efficient performance, landing with 47% accuracy tonight against Wei Li Zhang. Real sneaky body kick. Just over three minutes to go. Nice punch by Zhang Wei Li. Oh, beautifully done there. She lands another strike to the body. She blocked the punch. Straight right hand, but she misses. Throws the right hand there. Big body kick. We have crossed the midpoint of this fight. Sean gets hit with a kick. Oh, and there's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Zhang Weili. Weili going. Oh! She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to finish this fight. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Another clinch position. And there comes the separation now. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you'd want to see from her. He call a past fight of hers in which her striking has looked this fluid. She's sharp as a tack. Sharp as a tack. Everything is landing. She's doing a great job. Well, she's got a good jab. Missed with it there. Head kick lands. Oh, there's the hook shot. She's got every strike in the book. Every single strike, but the hook is her best punch. Oh, and she lands another punch here, and you can tell at this point she's targeting the cut on her opponent's eye. As she should be. She should be targeting the cut. It's there. That is her work, right? right? That right. was not an accident. Her opponent did not fall down and cut her eye. One of her strikes cut her eye, and now she's going to continue to put damage on that cut. Body kick now by Sean. Beautifully timed and place kick there by Sean Whaley. Back and forth we go! There's no give on that leg kick. Sean's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Nice punch there by Zhang Weili. Waning seconds here of round number three. She missed with that jab. Oh! What a fight so far. All right, that's the end of the round. And our cameraman all over that cut on the cheek. That thing is getting wider by the minute and only getting worse. Cut man gonna earn his money tonight. Well, a punch like that would have felled lesser women, but she survives and gets to fight another round. She's as tough as they come. She's sitting on her bench right now telling her coaches, I'm good, I'm ready to go. That was just a moment. I'm still gonna get the victory. I believe she has to change something. She cannot continue to do the same thing 
and expect a different result. All right, here we go. Fourth round of a possible five is now underway, and now is the time to see where the endurance, the cardio, and the overall skills of these women figures to be tested. Yes, both of them will be tested on the skill level, but also the mental level, the emotional level. It takes a lot to get through round four and five, and both of these women are gonna have to ace the test if they wanna get their hand raised at the end of the night. Beautiful body kick. All right, she's landed some pretty good shots here tonight, but still DC unable to string any solid combinations together. I just don't believe she's confident in being in there. She's very aware of her opponent's power, so it's making her limit her activity on the inside. Throw that out the window. You're the faster fighter. You're successful. Let those combinations string together. Oh, nice punch there by Sean. Liver kick. Oh, nice. Nice. How good is that right hand? Nice body kick right under the elbow. Powerful leg kick lands. Oh, she continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like she did in the previous round. It's one thing to be aggressive, but also efficient. She is certainly doing that. Just over three minutes to go. Zhang's lower jaw does not look good. I'm not sure it could be any more swollen. She continues to fight through it. Let's see how far she can go. Well, that left hand has been there for her tonight, not on that attempt. <laughs> Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Educated jab right there from Zhang Wei Li. This is a competitive division, but certainly looks like a fighter who could reign for some time. I mean, China's first UFC champion, and Wei Li, is the person that you want to see carrying the flag for her country. She has everything. She's even learned to speak English. Now she understands the importance of drawing people in and capturing the imagination of the fight fans around the world. Oh, nice jab. Nice straight punch. Try to establish that jab. Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. Just missed with the left there. Sean shot is blocked. Nice body kick. Well placed knee to the body. Oh, big head kick. She's looking to set up that head kick, no good. 30 seconds to go in the round. Sean gets caught with that punch. 15 seconds. Oh, she lands the left punch. Seconds to go. Oh, hard work pays off. Lands the Superman punch flush.
A lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a Telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my Telestrator right now. That was a great display of high-level mixed martial arts striking. Both combatants stood toe-to-toe -to -toe and let it all hang out. All right, here we go with our next round. Free headaches if you want them. How about all the volume of strikes landed for the headlock in the previous round? Oh, man, she's landing at an alarming rate over and over, dropping that right hand behind a beautiful jab. I think she Oh, big diamond punch to the head. All right, she postures up here, DC. We'll see if she can get those ground strikes. Watch for the huge elbows that she's known for. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, full guard now, DC. And just because she has the top position does not mean she is not in imminent danger. Oh, she's in danger at all moments. Whenever she already eliminates a vast majority of those submissions, move to half guard, then continue to try to advance to either get off great ground and pound or just positional advantages in the grappling. Trying to establish that jab once again. That's a big strike right there. Just out of the range with that right hand. Well, desperation time for her now. She is clearly behind on the judges' scorecards and as desperate as she needs to be, I'm not sure she's got the cardio to be desperate. I mean, at this point, I don't know what she can do to try to change the way this fight has been going. I, she finds herself out of cardio, out of options. I don't know what she can do to win this fight. Three minutes now to go to decide this one. Oh, she loaded up on that uppercut. No good, though. Beautiful body kick. That shot blocked by Zhang Wei Li. Lands flush with the left hand. Oh, you can see her limp it a little bit now. That leg is hurting for certain. Big kick lands. Going with the kick to the body, but unable to find the range. Right punches there. Just missing on the high kick there. Two minutes now to go in this one. Big punch lands through the middle. Big leg kick lands. Back and forth we go. Another leg kick lands. Again, in the clinch. Hook shot blocked, though, by the defense. Nice job getting that guard up to prevent any further damage. Nice loop of punch. Well, she's got a good jab. Miss with it there. Relax. Set up the shots. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Oh, is that a good knee to the body there by Zhang Wei Li? Big kick lands. Wei Li gets tagged by that straight punch. Nice land for the offense there. Just unable to quite find that range. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. 20 seconds left. And she misses with the left punch there. Oh, 
nice job by her to posture up there. Now we'll see if she can maintain that separation. She has to recognize that her opponent will start trying to squirrel away now, but look for her big ground and pound. All right, well, it wasn't easy, that's for sure, and it never is when you're taking on number one contenders left and right, but a championship effort out of the incumbent tonight. You saw her championship heart shine through in this fight. She was pushed on so many levels tonight, and she showed that not only is she one of the best champions we have, she is definitely one of the toughest champions we have in the entire UFC. See how the judges saw it. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 49 46. For the winner by unanimous decision, and still. Like the great Israel Adesanya, she doesn't hope and pray. She aims and fires, and she is in one of the UFC's best women's division.